Hi friends. Welcome to 30 Inks, 30 Days. What day are we on? 20? Day 20. Look at me remembering the day. Um, first up, looking at Cat's Eye Nebula. Wrote with this a bit, not great on my cream paper at night in my bedroom in low light. <laughs> you can see from the writing, it's kind of light. This splat is great looking though, right? Remember what I said about it looking like copper with the, but mostly patina? It still looks like that. I've also found my old spray sheet. And I put down a thing on my desk. And after cleaning it, so I feel like a responsible adult, sort of. Um, I don't have the pen handy to remind you. By the way, I did look up the name of the pen and I put it correctly in the description. It was the Twisby Mini AL Mint. I had it right the first time. So, um, let's pick an ink. Uh, here is our selection. Eyes are closed as usual. We're going over in this corner. This feels like maybe it's an old one. I don't know why I'm thinking that. Uh, let's see what we picked. Sailor Yurameku Zare Gokuro. Let's check it out. I think those were. There's Date Gokuro. Okay, um, this is going to be another fun one. It's a, a blue-black on here, but like with almost a brown sheen to my eye. Maybe it's that it's reddish but looks brown. And... What pin do we want to put this in? Do we want to put it in one of these? I don't know. I don't know. This has got a broad nib. That might be like a bit intense for this ink. And how about not a clear one that might be stained? Good thought, Maria. Um, so then I almost reached for my platinum 3776. It's clear. <laughs> oh, Maria, you blowhard. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to do my Lamy Safari in petrol with the left-handed nib. Am I going to try and fill directly from that? Yeah, friends, yeah I am. Is it gonna work? Source is hazy, check back later. Look at how, look at the surface tension. Can you see that? Let's zoom in for you. Okay. That was lovely. I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did. Oh, your. There is ink in here. Everybody, they, I filled from a vial. Hold up. Stop the presses. First off, I cleaned my ink rag and it's not here. So I'm just using random scrap of fabric that is destined for recycling. If I can find somewhere that will recycle fabric. It's like they don't expect people to be doing a lot with fabric. I don't know why, though, because quilting is a big hobby here, even if garment making isn't. That would upset Manda. Let's try and do it. 
the right way for her. There, Amanda, for you, Lamy lines up with Nib. Amanda made me do it. Okay. Inked. By the way, lefties, I have not found much of a difference with this nib. <laughs> but hey, you know, support, support it because then there's a better chance of lefties being supported in general, maybe? I don't know. So this today is Sailor Yuramaku Zare Gokoro in my Lamy Safari Petrol with the left-handed nib. I did that for Amanda. She hasn't asked me to or anything. You know what I like about the, that you can do with the Safari? You can rest it on its clip so that it sort of like hovers a little. I dig it. I'm easily amused though, it turns out. So this is like, it's funny because the to me, the first Yoramaku inks that I tried were very, they felt like, you know, those more, what are you doing, Maria? Those more watery sort of inks. And then these are all like far more saturated and lubricated by comparison. Well, are they lubricated? I don't know, but they're far more saturated. So it was kind of like you expected one thing from the Yuramaku line, but got another um, when they did the new ones. No complaints. So here it is on this paper. We can scroll back. Scroll back, everybody. What the? F and see what it looked like originally. Um, I, tr I I cleaned this so many times, but there's like shimmer. So we're gonna have shimmer in here with some of our inks that aren't shimmery, and it's gonna be fine. We're gonna roll with it. We're gonna take it as an addition to the day that makes us happy. <clears throat> so. Pretty inks, 30 days. September 2023, day 20. My hand is like, what are you trying to do? What's this writing that you speak of? Sailor Yuramaku. Sare Kokoro. Bought this on a trip to the UK at a WH Smith. Many years ago now. And then this cracked. And I glued it. But Let's splat. I like this. It's dark. Look how dark that water is. It is a beautiful blue in the water. And the writing does have that sheen over it that's like maybe bronzy. Mmm, that smell of sailor inks. You know what I'm talking about if you've had any. It's probably their mold inhibitor. You can even see, like, at least in the freshly inked writing sample, um, you get a lot of sheen because it's so juicy. Um, 
we're going to risk doing the calendar page in the thing. Also, this was from five. So here is Zare Gokuro. Looks mostly the same. This one doesn't, isn't as drastically different or dramatically different, if you will, between the two papers. Not like uh, um, Suki Gokuro was. Uh, not uh, complaining. You know, just a data point. So we have... I am dreadfully behind in my transcription. I just did part of day five last night. So <laughs> got a lot of writing ahead of me. Not a lot of time to write in. Such is life. Well, there's time to write in, but then I'm choosing to do other things, right? Like play video games or have existential crises. Um, you know, the usual. <laughs> Last night was a rough night for me, friends. I'm okay today, mostly. We're mostly okay today, mostly. So here is today. The splat is still not dry. I didn't expect it to be, but um, we've got Sailor Yurameku Zare Gokuro in the Lamy Safari Petrol with the left handed nib. That almost sounds like I'm accusing somebody in Clue. <laughs> it was. It was Sailor Yurameku Zare Gokuro with the Lamy Safari Petrol in the conservatory. Let's check the, the envelope. Um, all right. <laughs> Thank you, everyone, for hanging out with me today. I hope whenever you're watching this, you're having a wonderful day. Take care of yourselves. Bye.